Jeremy Clarkson has sparked backlash online as the former Top Gear star boasted on board a luxury boat to A-level students. Jeremy Clarkson reacted as hundreds of thousands of students are getting their A-level results today. But for many, there will be sighs of relief, but for others, it will be a disappointment. The ex-Top Gear star urged Britons to fear not as he shared his annual tweet. The 62-year-old, who only got a C, and to us in his exams 40-odd years ago, has admittedly done very well for himself in life. In the past, Jeremy has boasted of his material gains including his luxury purchases from a Mercedes-Benz, to various homes, to holiday breaks in the south of France. Taking to Twitter today, the car enthusiast assured disappointed students to not fret over bad results. In view of his 7.8 million followers, Jeremy penned, Don't worry if your level results are disappointing. I got a C and two us and I'm currently holidaying on this boat. He accompanied the post with a picture on board the boat surrounded by mountains in a picturesque landscape with stunning views. But his annual post sparked some backlash on social media as some people hit out at the Clarkson's farm star. Twitter user, at Joan Richard penned, What an arrogant comment. There isn't any more room for a dinosaur like you. Non-partial rent tweeted, Wait, did he really just suggest that holidaying on a boat is an alternative to disappointing a levels? Fail. F's asterisk 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 my life. Raiden G1985 commented, Not helpful. The world has changed since then, and employers are looking for academic qualifications more than ever before. At 16, I walked into a job in McDonald's. Now they look for exam results because the job market is saturated. At scene underscore boom hit back, if you'd have applied yourself, maybe you could have owned the boat and the holiday company. At LUFC underscore Cohen said, he really doesn't understand humility does he? Others were delighted by Jeremy's annual A-level tweet as at Steinwolf 27 remarked, you know you are doing just fine when you have a boat on board of another boat. Monty 166 underscore TL tweeted, Wise words from Jeremy here. Hard work and determination will get you where you want to be. It's not all about school, college, university results. At Red Donny agreed. Great tweet, Jeremy. It is what it is. If they're not the results you wanted, it's not the end of the world. Aristotle added. Look at it this way. He's not saying I did poorly at my levels and I'm rich anyway. He may well be, but I think he's actually saying I did poorly at my levels and I'm H-A-P-P-Y anyway. I'm not rich, but I'm happy. I'm comfortably off and I did very poorly at a levels. On results day in August last year, Jeremy tweeted, If the teachers didn't give you the A-level results you were hoping for, don't worry. I got a C and two us and I've ended up happy, with loads of friends and a Bentley. While exams were put on hold due to the restrictions, Many GCSE and A-level students were told they would receive their predicted grade as their final grade, causing havoc among teachers and students and creating huge disruption for many people's university plans. This year's A-level students are the first to sit exams since the outbreak of COVID-19, which played havoc with the UK's school assessment system. They are the first cohort to sit exams since the outbreak of coronavirus, which plunged the assessment system into chaos. Jeremy has enjoyed a successful career in television as the former host of Top Gear, the current frontman for Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, and recently released his hit reality series, Clarkson's Farm.